pembelanjaan militer dunia selama 2017 mencapai angka tertinggi sejak akhir Perang Dingin, menurut laporan Lembaga Riset Stockholm International Peace Research Institute. Military spending at 1.7 trillion dollars is um, high for the ninth straight year in a row. Um, we see substantial increases in Chinese military spending. Uh, US military spending has remained constant for the second consecutive year. Amerika Serikat, Tiongkok, dan Arab Saudi menempati peringkat tiga besar. China has increased its military spending for the 29th consecutive year. Um, they are the second largest spender in the world at around 228 billion dollars. Um, we've seen a 110% increase over the last 10 years. Bersamaan dengan peningkatan pembelanjaan militer Tiongkok, pembelanjaan negara-negara sekitarnya ikut naik, termasuk Jepang, India, serta Indonesia. Sementara itu negara yang banyak berseberangan dengan AS dan sekutu-sekutunya yakni Rusia justru mengalami penurunan pembelanjaan militer sebesar 20 persen. Penurunan signifikan ini terjadi di saat Rusia terlibat secara militer dalam konflik di Suriah dan juga berbagai konflik-konflik di sekitar kawasannya sendiri. Perkembangan ini cukup mengejutkan peneliti. I think one of the big surprises has been the sharp drop in Russian military spending, partly due to the economic problems they have had with the oil, low oil prices, as well as last year they had a, a high increase because they had to repay some of the military debt, and so last year was actually an overspend. Basically, they have an economic economic problem since 2014. Defense has been. Um, a bit protected, but 2017 basically the economy has caught up and also military spending uh, has to suffer. AS masih menempati posisi teratas dengan pembelanjaan mencakup 35 persen pembelanjaan global, melebihi total dari tujuh negara selanjutnya dalam daftar peringkat pembelanjaan militer. Dari Washington DC, Nova Purwadi, VOA.